Hey everybody, this is Russ with Smokes Rolling. How y'all doing? I am down here in, well, I'm south of Atlanta, Georgia on I-75 at the Flying J on Buck Snort Road. Love that name, right? Anyways, I called my wife. I told her I was getting ready to park and I asked her if she could tell me if there was a store that was nearby here. So she got on Google and looked and she said there's a place across the street called Old Rudy's. Now, Old Rudy's is a barbecue. Actually, let me go back a little bit. She said there was a place about a couple miles away called Old Rudy's. That's what I get for asking my wife to help me. But anyway, it's actually across the street and they've got truck parking there. I just wanted to park here at Flying J so I could take a shower and stuff. But I'm gonna go over there and check out Old Rudy's and see what the, what the barbecue's like. How about y'all join me? Let's go. All right, y'all, here we are at Old Rudy's. He's got himself a big old portable pit here, man. Check this out. Chicken, ribs, brisket, smoked wings, Brun Brunswick stew. Mmm, yummy. I don't know about the Brunswick stew, but... Man, I'm gonna have to do the chicken, ribs, brisket, and smoked wings. Yummy. Got himself a nice little pit over here, man. I'm digging that. You see that? That's awesome. Let's go check out and see what they got. All right, let's check this out. I think I'm gonna get me the three ribs, four ounce of pork, a 15 ounce brisket, and six wings for 25.63. Let's check this out and see if it's any good or not. Okay. Can I get the uh, three ribs, the four ounces of pork, the 15 ounce brisket, and the six wings? Okay, the four, okay. What's your two sides, sir? Get two sides with that? Yes, sir. Awesome. I will take, uh, how about slaw and potato salad? Okay, coleslaw, potato salad? Yep. Anything to drink today? Nope, I'm good, man. Okay. So there you have it. 27.40, and we got a lot of food. It's warm out here. I'm probably gonna take this to the truck, but I can't wait to give this a try, man. I'm uh, going to be going to uh, Texas here uh, starting tomorrow. I won't make it there, but uh, probably the day after we're going to stop in Texas. Try out a barbecue joint there. And maybe I'll catch that for you guys too. All right? So uh, I'm waiting for this food to get done, and uh, we'll be right back with you. All right, you guys. We're back here in the truck. The reason why I wanted to be in the truck is because you just never, I can't trust anybody. I got too many electronics, too many, too much expensive stuff in here. But this is what we got. Uh, this is just a sampling size that I put on a plate of my own. And right here, I've got smoked chicken wings. Right here is the brisket. Now the first thing I noticed about the brisket, man, it's sliced super thin. It tells me it's going to be dry. Um, pork ribs I don't know how good you can see that not much of a smoke ring on these it smells delicious so I'll tell you that much this is the pulled pork right here now right here is something very interesting potato salad I've never seen an orange potato salad before now, I've tasted it already it's really super mayonnaise -y. so keep that in mind if you ever come here and that is some interesting looking slaw. I don't think that I've seen slaw like that. Another thing that you get, nice size little tub, sauce. Can't wait to try that. And about a half a loaf of bread it seems like. It looks like uh, six slices in there. So I'm gonna take a taste of this and let you know what I think. All right guys, well I just finished the barbecue and first of all, let me say for 25 whatever it was, it was pretty much a damn disappointment to me. Um, as a matter of fact, the only thing that I really thought was good was the sauce. Nice and spicy, had a nice flavor to it, and thank God for it, because it was the only thing that washed it down. The only thing I didn't try was the bread. And I guarantee that that would have been better than this barbecue. 
it's a shame too because he's got a nice setup there he's got an air-conditioned pavilion that you can sit in a uh, place for trucks truck drivers to park uh, there's another gazebo there that's got uh, four picnic tables uh, in it and you can sit down in the shade and then there's another area that has four or six picnic tables that you can sit out in the sun it's also got umbrellas on them if you like that uh, but overall the barbecue itself was a disappointment it really was there was no flavor it was totally dry the ribs man I was super disappointed with the ribs uh, the brisket wasn't too bad but I guarantee I know I can make better and many of you can as well uh, the smoked chicken wings were pretty good. It didn't have an overwhelming smoke flavor, which is perfect because you, you It's possible that you can over smoke them and it's just it, they become rancid and nasty tasting. They were okay um, The pulled pork Man, I was not pleased with that The coleslaw was pretty good the uh, Potato salad, you know, I thought it was real super mayonnaise-y, but I just tasted the, the wet ingredients, I guess, when I first tasted it. And it was okay. I think the potatoes could have been done a lot more, but it was just interesting to me to see potato salad with a pinkish-orange tint to it. Uh, but overall, man, this place is a total disappointment. I wouldn't waste my money here again um, but unfortunately I spent the money for it so I gotta eat it it's just the way it goes but that's my review on old Rudy's smoke shack I guess barbecue whatever uh, just uh, it's a it's across the street from the flying J in uh, south of Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, man, it's hot down here. I enjoy sitting in my truck. It's nice and air conditioned. But y'all have a great day. And hey, we'll talk to you later. I'm gonna try to do another review of a place in Texas. There's two places I want to stop and I'm only gonna stop at one. So it's kind of up to me to which one I want to go to. Well, actually there's three places I'd like to stop. But I'm only gonna stop at one. So we'll see which one we're gonna uh, but this rust with smokes rolling. Good to see you all again. It's nice, by the way, for you guys that are able to barbecue and drink beer out here. I can't do that. So um, enjoy yours. I mean, I can eat the barbecue, but I can't drink beer. It sucks. But hey, we'll talk to you later. Smokes rolling, y'all. Take care.